Okay, so you're gonna want to start off with your essentials. So I have my um, my scissors. These are just to cut off the sleeves and um, to help with the distressing. Also, um, I have these scissors are actually for trimming your hair, but this edge is really sharp. You can also use um, like a razor blade, but um, this is a little safer than that. And you're also going to need a pair of tweezers. These are just some cheap ones that I've had for a long time. Um, and then also, of course, your jacket, your jean jacket or jean shorts or jean um, pants that you want to distress. Okay, so the first step you want to do is cut off the sleeves of your jacket for your vest. I already did it on one side, so I'm just going to match up the other side. Um, and what you're going to want to do is cut about an inch away from the seam of the armhole. And when you get to the top part, you kind of just want to go straight up. Just like that. Now we're going to start distressing. As you can see, I already started on this piece here. Um, so yeah, this is what it looks like before you wash it. So um, I just did this one not too long ago. So I'm going to do that to the other side. And what that piece is, is just this uh, piece of triangle here. I just decided to distress all of that. So um, get your scissors. And um, what you're going to want to do is cut some slits in the piece that you want to um, distress. Now what you're going to want to do is um, get your tweezers, which I have no idea where to put mine. Get your tweezers. Now for this part where you have the slits, you kind of want to wiggle that piece of fabric around. This will loosen up those threads so it's easier for you to take out um, the blue threads that you need to take out. So just kind of loosen them up so it's easier to work with. So for this part you take your tweezers and just pull out, um, pull in a downward motion and you're going to pull out these little blue hairs or the blue threads. And um, I have thicker tweezers, I don't have like the really sharp ones so that way I don't really snag on the white threads so it's easy for me to um get the blue threads out and you just kinda pluck at them and then the white threads stay there so this doesn't take too long, it's actually kinda easy
Okay, so this is what it looks like after a few um, of my strips have been shredded. So that's what it looks like. So I'm just going to finish up the rest and then, um, yeah, I'll show you what it looks like. Okay, so I finished my both of my um, distressed sides. So that's that. I'm going to um, distress some other pieces probably in the back of the vest. I started a little piece here. I'll probably bring this up a little bit on both sides. And then, um, yeah, and then I'll show you the finished product when I'm done doing that. Okay, so here's the finished product. I have this side here. Um, I distressed this side. And then in the back, I distressed just these bottom two parts here. So if you just want the regular like jean vest shape, you can stop there. But um, right now, if you want to learn how to do the razorback um, vest, that is what I'm going to show you next. Okay, to start on the razorback part of the um, vest, you want to kind of change the shape of the armholes that we cut before. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to... I have this button here at the top, so I have to kind of get rid of that. So I'm going to cut on the other side of it, straight down, and then just kind of merge it into the um, rest of it because I don't want to cut that pocket off. So I'm going to show you what I'm talking about. So I'm just going to kind of start. So I'm just going to kind of start cutting. And um, there we go. And then like that. I'm going to do the same on the other side. So I have my my um, sleeves altered the way I need them to be. Now I'm going to flip it to the back. And this is what's going to give it the razor back look. So what you want to do is you want to cut in and then kind of like go straight up. And that will give it the um, razor back look that you need it to have. So let me just start... and just kind of cut a so essentially all you're really doing is just cutting your um, vest and making the um, back armholes larger see what I did there? so I'm going to do the same on the other side Alright, so I have basically everything done. Now all I want to do is take those trimming scissors that I have, take that sharp end, and I'm just going to kind of run that blade along the edge where the armhole is. And that's just going to help it fray a little more once you pop it into the washer and dryer. Um, so you get that really distressed look around the armholes. So just kind of lightly, you don't really have to do it too much, it's basically just loosening the, um, loosening those threads around the armhole. So yeah, I did that on both sides, and then all I'm going to do is pop it in the wash and dryer, and um, yeah, I'll show you the very finished product. 